creamy decadence of double cream bliss from Clover. Yogurt has never been so irresistible. Made with love by Clover. From all that masala knowledge to the spices and the incredible recipes that Chef you have in store. Oh yeah, so we have the Rogan Josh that we're going to be cooking today. Mm. Um, the name Rogan Josh, basically Rogan sort of means ghee or clarified butter or sort of oil. And then your Josh is like hot, fiery. In um, Hindu, it means passion, actually. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm so glad that Chef has brought that up because, you know, it made me ask you, South Africa, have you ever wondered what a Rogan Josh curry is? Well, Chef Dion is in the house to teach us all how to make this fiery Indian curry. We're also going to make a refreshing cucumber raita with clover bliss double cream yogurt that will help you turn down the heat without losing any of that curry flavor. Now, Domi, you've already started. Um, I'm so glad that Chef has brought broken down exactly what uh, a Rogan Josh is because, honey, I was clueless. But there's also <laughs> another element to this dish, which is that refreshing cucumber raita. Right. So do you want to, like, just talk us through what we need for this? Awesome stuff. Funny to make our raita, one thing I've noticed that's the base most times whenever you're making a raita is cucumber. It's refreshing. It is clean. You know, there's something about eating a cucumber that just refreshes your palate. You know, and I think there's nothing that pairs even better than some uh, plain yogurt, double cream, thick yogurt. So that works perfectly in a raita. So I've got some cucumber, I've got some spring onion, I've got some coriander, fresh coriander, which is always, I think, necessary whenever you're making a raita or oh, any yes. type of savory dish of the sort. And then we've also got a little bit of garam masala. So in, in this instance, Bali, instead of grating it, which is, what is normally what people would do, we're gonna chop it up into nice, beautiful little cubes and, and add our spring onion. And then, Chef, you can maybe take us through the ingredients and spices we need for the actual curry itself, with okay. Rogan Josh. Yeah, so for the Rogan Josh, we've got a bit of lamb pieces over here. I've added the oil in already and I'm starting to brown it. Mm -hmm. We've got some diced onions, some chopped tomatoes that are peeled, um, skinned and chopped up. There's a bit of crushed garlic. Cumin, ground coriander, we've got a bit of sugar, chili flakes, salt, pepper, and a touch of turmeric, and then some garam masala as well. Beautiful. And on my side, I'm just chopping up some fresh ginger, some fresh garlic, and of course, um, some greens on the side to pair perfectly with the cucumber raita. Correct, yes. And correct. the thing with raita, it's like, there's so many different variations of it. You can add dough to your yogurt, you mm -hmm. can add onion chopped to your yogurt. You can literally add garlic as well, because mm. the main objective is to sort of tune down the hot, fiery spiciness of your actual curry. And as you are speaking about the hot, fiery, nat fiery nature of a curry, I love the fact, yeah, that we're partnering it up with the Clover Double Bliss Yogurt. Mm. And what's so special about it, it's delicious, it's thick, it's creamy, and of course, that double cream indulgent yogurt. I mean, it's nutritious, simply decadent to me. Perfect, Balisa. The one thing I love about this, is Chef broke it down for us and said, Rogan Josh is about heat. Yeah. So what better to clear your palate and refresh you for the next spoon of your Rogan Josh than a beautiful double thick creamy clover bliss yogurt, yo. And the one thing I love about it, yes, we've got it in the one kg packaging now, Balista, but you also get it in the 500 gram um, packaging. And for some of us that have little mini ones running around, you've also got it in the 175 gram. So you just throw it into this cup too when school's open again. Or if you have Auntie Pally coming to visit, <laughs> she likes to just sneak a little 175 gram and I kind of eat it at the corner there. Because what I love about bliss is that it is an incredible source of 10 vitamins. It's kosher and halal. So it's just, it's, it's good to go. It doesn't matter your food preferences and what you're trying to do with your diet. Clover Bliss Double Cream Yogurt is here for you. Now, Chef, also, the sugar, now I'm saying sugar because I see you putting in sugar. <laughs> the meat, the meat, the meat, the meat, the protein. Yes. How can we ensure that our lamb or whatever protein we want to use for our Rogan Josh is, is, is absolutely kept, integ the integrity of the meat is kept, the flavor, the nutrients, and it's succulents as well? I think the important thing is not to boil your meat. Mm. So once your curries, so your spices are cooked, as we can see now, and it sort of separates from the oil, like I explained on Tuesday. Yeah. Then what you do is keep your heat down to a very low, low to medium. And you want to sort of like simmer your meat through the process. So it doesn't agitate the filaments and sort of like dry it out as well. You mm. keep that integrity of it and that nice, moist sort of pull apart meat. 
Yes, that's what yes, it's what all you... about. There's nothing like struggling through your meat when you're enjoying a curry. Let do. At all, Palisa, yeah. there's one thing I do not enjoy. Whenever I make my stews, I want to make sure that the meat literally falls off of the bone, sure. you know? And so it's perfect that if it doesn't fall off the bone, in fact, Chef, do you want me to add a bit of bliss here? Because I think yeah, it'll make not? a huge difference to your I'll curry. Be, if I'm... Boom, okay. Boom. <laughs> and Chef, isn't it also true by adding some Clover Bliss double cream yogurt, it also helps to tenderize the meat? Mm. Oh, yes, when you marinate your meat so it's got like bacteria inside of it yeah. good bacteria that sort of soften the enzymes of the meat or your chicken often fish as well if you add it onto it yeah love that a and gamey we, fish so we're taking it um double ways as it is a double cream we're mm -hmm. adding it in our curry and our rogan josh but we're also um adding it there within your raita yes palisa because the raita is not a raita with some clover bliss double cream yogurt and palisa i'm almost done here with my uh -huh. raita so what we've got we've got those cute that cucumber that i beautifully cubed in there i've got our spring onion that i added i added some coriander a bit of garam masala and i topped it all off or finished it all off with our decadently delicious clover bliss double cream yogurt love that now i'm so excited to start dishing this incredible um masterpiece up in fact chef just leave a little bit of greens for me because i'm going to do so <laughs> right here no problem now do we've also ensured that we partner it and we pair it with a delicious rice definitely palissa because i think we've also asked our, our viewers on social media whether you would pair it with a roti whether <laughs> it's with rice i uh, definitely think any of them is works as long as your meat is perfect Love yeah, 100% Here you go with your writer, Mama. Thank you. And voila, Mzanti, just get the recipe over <laughs> at afternoonexpress.co.za.